Hey guys, it's Jeremy from HockeyReviewHQ.com. Today I'm doing a review of the Smart Hockey Stick Handling Ball. I've been using this for quite a while, so I'm going to do a full review on it, tell you what I think about it, and uh, just give you a bit of information about it. First, I'll give you a nice close-up look. Here is the Smart Hockey Stick Handling Ball, a nice close-up look for you. You can see this one's a bit beat up. Uh, I've been using this one for probably over six months now. I'm surprised I haven't lost it yet, but I've used it on asphalt and pavement, a nice smooth surface as well, and it is still in great condition. I use it all the time and it's got a nice durable outer core so it's going to last a really long time. As far as the size, um, it is smaller than a puck, so you can see the puck there in the background. Um, it's also taller than a hockey puck, but the idea is that line right there is the same point that your stick is going to contact the puck. So it was made to have the same contact point as a puck and also it's a bit lighter than a puck, but on ice a puck slides really easily so it feels lighter. So they made this a bit lighter so it feels the same as a puck would feel on the ice. So that's sort of like a smart design, that's what they call it, I guess, smart hockey. And now I'm just going to use it and give you a few, a bit more information. Here's me just using the stick handling ball and right now I'm just doing some quick hands, trying to move the ball back and forth really quickly and then I do a few deeks or wide movements, so just moving it quick to one side or the other. And uh, I just like to, you know, try a whole bunch of different things. There's tons of drills you can do with a stick handling ball or a green biscuit or a puck. And if you want to see uh, 20 stick handling drills that you can do off ice, just check out our review. And I have a link to uh, 20 off ice stick handling drills. And uh, yeah, I just like to do toe drags and all kinds of stuff. So that's just me using the ball. And uh, now I'm just going to give you my overall views on it. Overall, definitely like the Smart Hockey Stick Handling Ball. It's actually something that I think every hockey player should have just because it's something that you can throw down and you can pack your stick handling anytime you want. So, I mean, I have one in my hockey bag, I have one in my house, and I probably have you know a few other ones lying around that, here and there. I just like to use them for, you know, if I get bored, I toss down a stick handling ball, mess around with it a bit. Um, there's a bunch of products that I like for stick handling. I recommend I use a golf ball, I use the Smart Hockey Stick Handling Ball, I have the wooden stick handling balls, the green biscuit I love and just a regular hockey puck and a weighted puck. So I mean there's five or six different things that I just have on my shooting pad and you know when I'm doing practice, when I'm practicing stick handling I just you know I mess around with one and then the next one and the next one and it just works your muscles in different ways. Uh, you know golf balls bounce around so you gotta be really quick. Uh, this one feels a lot like a ball. Uh, the green biscuit is nice and flat and has the same physics as a puck so I like that. So those are some things that you can use but I definitely recommend having the smart hockey stick handling ball. Toss one in your hockey bag you can practice before a game, warm up in the dress room a little bit, and just get that feel. So uh, pick one of these up, head over to HockeyReviewHQ.com, and we have a full review, we have links to where you can get it, and just a little bit more information about the Smart Hockey Stick Handling Balls. Thanks a lot for watching the video, guys. See you in the next one. And if you have used one of these, leave your comment in the section below. See ya.